Hey what's up guys, Weeder Fan here. Today I'm going to show you what's in my opinion probably the highest valued uh, hunting knife set on the market. This is the Buck Omni Hunter and Caper Combo. So there's two knives in the sheath. Uh, quick run around of the sheath. So there's two separate compartments for the for the Omni and the Pack Light. Uh, the Omni comes out strap right here, the caper has a hat strap right here, uh, all nylon construction, got the buck logo stitched in right here which is nice, uh, just pretty standard, just a belt loop, nylon belt loop stitched on right here, see we got the little code right here, Let's see, buck is uh, stamped into the buttons which is nice. So, now, let's have a look at the knives. So here we have the uh, the caper, it's the model 135, so there's no handle scales, this is the, the pack light models. And before I go into any details, I'll just show you the other one. This is the Buck Omni Hunter, the gut hook model, it's the model 393 beast of a knife. So let's talk about the models. Uh, before I start on the knives actually guys, one thing I forgot to mention is that both uh, both knife pouches here have a, a plastic insert, a mobile plastic insert so you will not cut up your nylon sheath. Real nice feature, that's always nice to see. So we'll start off here with the pack like caper. This was featured in my uh, sharpening and shaving video. Both of these knives, made in the USA, both Buck Signature 420 High Carbon Steel. So, obviously, full tang construction, it's all exposed tang. Very light, almost weightless, but uh, nice smooth curve on this. Very nice, it's called the Caper, the Caper model. Very nice for skinning small animals or caping, work up around, around the head of an animal or something like that. Uh, no, it has no handle scales. I've seen people have paracord wrapped these. I've seen people have made their own little sets of scales for these. But I really don't see it being necessary. Uh, Buck has really thought out the jimping on this. And it actually has quite a bit of traction. So first of all, uh, all jimping along here against this nice choil. So it really gives you quite a good grip. Followed by a second finger grip. All jimping along here, and then jimping here and here for the rest of your hand. So you can really lock onto this knife. So just give you a closer look here. Pretty nice jimping actually. Uh, fairly sharp. Got the nice buck knife stamp. The anvil, the model number. Uh, awesome, wonderful. So the caper has roughly a two and a half inch blade length seven inch roughly overall length okay so here's the shining star of the set this is the buck 393 omni hunter as already said this is the gut hook model very nice wide gut hook buck usa stamp see it has the model model 393 stamp right here uh... very nice design right quick here, the handle is uh, called an Alcrin rubber, so if you haven't felt it before, it's actually a really sticky rubber, provides a lot of grip. And this handles, handle design is fantastic. This curve right here, so you can actually grip back here, there's lots of a jimping molded into the, the handle. Nice choil right here, so you can get right up, or a step further, you can really lock up right here and a lot of jimping so they really thought out the traction pattern for this set of knives so size we have uh, so roughly roughly a four inch cutting edge runs back about four and a half total to the handle handle runs about five and a half inches and overall tip to tail of about nine and three quarters to ten inches. 
So it's a pretty sizable knife. Full tang construction. And for proof, you look in this nice convenient lanyard hole so you can put a strap on there, but you can see the tang right there. 420 high carbon steel, hollow grind. See it's real deep belly on this knife. So you have a, uh, a real nice curved design for skinning. Real nice setup. It's fairly weighty, but I think it suits this knife well. Really feels like you have a lot of authority in your hand. Uh, just to compare the size of both of these knives to a more common, maybe a common EDC. Here's the Spider Co Tenacious. So let me just throw this here in the middle. So you can see this, uh, the Omni Hunter is a pretty sizable knife. It's a beastly knife. Probably a bit more than you'd want for uh, smaller animals like rabbits or something like that. But uh... So here's the key point about this set. I got this set about a year ago for uh, 50 bucks on Amazon. That was the regular price at the time. To get all this made in USA, 420 high carbon steel, both knives, well designed knives, uh, for 50 bucks is an unbeatable deal. Now the price has since gone up to around, uh, it's gone up to 80, I've seen it 80, and uh, I've seen it lowered back down. I think right now is about 70 bucks, I looked this morning. So uh, still, uh, the deal is unbeatable in my opinion. What you get for the money, this is kind of uh, almost an all-inclusive set, what, what you'll get with this here. Anyways, guys, this is the Buck Omni Caper Combo. So if you're trying to find it online, you type in Buck Omni Caper Combo, you will pull up this set. Awesome set, awesome deal. Check it out. Anyways, guys, that's it for this set. I'll throw them back in the sheath. Just another quick look at the sheath here. Nice heavy stitching, plastic inserts. Great setup for the price. I really don't think you can uh, find a better value than this. Go check it out.